God has placed within you some special and unique gifts that when you discern them and follow them will allow you to fulfill your destiny with a sense of joy as you do it. It's important to enjoy the work you're doing, and if you're doing work that is coming out of the gifts that God's placed within you, you will find it enjoyable. And so we're going to take you through some profiles, a dozen different profiles, uh, which we've found in the New Testament, ideas from the New Testament, and we're going to let you test yourself out and find out, hey, what makes me tick? What do I love? What do I enjoy? So that you can find a job, find a vocation, and find a ministry that is an outworking of the gift mix that God has placed within you. And we also want to teach you that if you want to succeed, you want to draw around yourself a winning team of people, people who have gifts that are different from your gifts, and then ask for their input, ask for their advice, and honor it, and include it into your final decisions, because the New Testament promises, if you do that, you can come to maturity. Your business, business can come to maturity, your ministry can come to maturity, you can come to maturity. So two books, Gifted to Succeed and How to Build a Winning Team, will help you establish this in your life. Directly beneath the video that you're watching, you can click on a Go Deeper tab, which will offer you three options for internalizing this message. Option number one is you get a home group or a Sunday school class, a group of your friends, and you spend 12 weeks watching the DVDs and internalizing the message. Option number two is you hire a personal spiritual trainer, a coach, for a dollar a day who will connect with you weekly uh, for the next 12 weeks to help you internalize the message. And option number three is take this as a university course with Christian Leadership University. Why don't you select the approach that's right for you so that you fully and completely internalize this message and are transformed by it.